Hello guys, I'm planting a Moringa Olifera. I nursed it. I put them here for silver. while they're growing. They're doing very well, the nursery. And I have to plant them on the ground. Normally they say this hole has to be like two feet deep. Uh, but I just made it like not even up to 10 inches or 9 inches deep. Uh, I'm going to try it. Um, I'm going to put some azomite in there first. Sprinkle some azomite. I nurse it with uh, azomite also. But I'll sprinkle some azomite. I got a little bit of azomite here. Uh, yeah, that's azomite. Yeah, azomite. I'm just going to sprinkle it in there. And uh, my wife bought some potted soil, potting mix. I'll sprinkle some on the, on the floor and then before I put it. Remember, I don't press it. Put it there, in there. And then sprinkle a little bit of azomite on top. That's what I do. Azomite is my secret. <laughs> a little bit of azomite on top. I go to the next one. Okay, it's my next one here. <sighs> All I do is this is it. I put a little bit of a uh, potting mix there, and then I just took it out of the can. You can see some of the roots. Then uh, I just put it there like that. I don't have to put it very deep in the ground. Yeah. I'm gonna bring my soil and put it back in. I don't press it. Don't press it, don't compress it. I'm just gonna put this on top of here. It's gonna have the natural nutrient that it had. I'm putting this around my fence. It's my house. I hope a few months from now, I'll be enjoying some uh, Moringa. Yeah. Okay. That one is done. Sprinkle my little bit of azomite. Uh, azomite is my secret. Azomite is my secret. Azomite. Just a little bit. Give you some nutrients there. Uh, like they said, Moringa Olifera doesn't really need too much. It's a very resilient plant. It grows. Doesn't need a lot of water. But here in Texas, that it gets very hot and the Texas soil is very clay, clay soil. I'm really curious to see how it's gonna do here. Yeah.